Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and I had a police officer send me a photograph of this badge, and he wants me to engrave it on a plaque. And it's uh, so I'm going to show you a couple little tricks. This is going to be a, a, a two-part uh, video. Uh, I'm going to show you how I how I got these lines, kind of like a starburst pattern, kind of like the badge. Uh, he didn't want me to spend a lot of time again. This is going to engrave really good. I think it's going to look really good. But anyway, to, to draw the, the lines, I've got a, uh, one of the badges here. And I'm going to, I put my, where I wanted my line to start right here. And I've got my line. So I'm going to control D, make a duplicate. Then I'm going to double click on, I'm going to move my rotation to the center of that star. And then I'm going to rotate it three degrees. And that's just what I came up with. And this is this is relatively easy and and simple. And then I'm gonna make a duplicate again. Make sure my rotation is still there. It is not. So I'll put it back. Now I'm gonna rotate it 357 degrees because I'm going the opposite direction. And I don't know why it did that. It started backing up for some reason. So we'll, we'll make a duplicate of this and rotate it 349 degrees. Well, I guess I backed up too far. Three, 39. Okay, I didn't make a duplicate. So go back, control D, take that one away, control D, 339, control D, 339. All right, and then you got your star pattern. Now you've got a problem. You've got your lines going through your letters. And that will be the next video on how to get rid of those lines without taking a, a really long time. Hope that helped a little bit. And thank you for watching.